Hey guys, Ernie of Kitchen here with Kitchen Tumblers and today we are so excited because we are unboxing the three cup turner cup of source and let's go ahead and get started. I know you saw my raw footage unboxing of the nine cup turner and the nine cup turner is fantastic. It's phenomenal. It's wonderful. I love it. And I also wanted to get a compact turner that when I'm not spinning several cups at one time, I could just be spinning a few. And I also wanted to get this turner because sometimes when I do the epoxy method, when I'm using my glitters and stuff like that, um, I don't want to have to use all nine of the turners at once. That nine cup turner is going to be utilized quite frequently, but utilized for when I have several cup orders and I'm epoxying on epoxy day, okay? So, as we know, Cup of Source likes to box their things wonderfully and they ship it perfectly. So, we already saw that in the nine cup turner video, but I'm gonna go ahead and open it up and see that they have this letter here that says thank you. And it says thank you for purchasing the Cup of Source. It only takes a few minutes to be up and running. And that is absolutely true because we saw that with the nine cup turner. So, let's zoom in close here. And as you can see, wonderfully packaged. All right, this is the Etsy. Um, oh, and you know what? They gave us a free package of glitter. So this is Don't Be Salty. They do provide glitters, and this is an extra fine glitter. Um, two ounces. Of a white glitter and I wanted to try their white glitter so I'm excited about that all right so we got the pink this time the cup of swords Rex nine cup turner was green so now we've got some pink going on I will list pricing and all of that below So, I don't know if you remember, but when I got my green one, I had a green dinosaur, so because I got pink, I guess I got a cute little red and pink dinosaur. Alright, I'm going to just drop all that. So now we've got our legs, and we've got Starburst this time, because it's getting warm, so I guess they decided to let the chocolate go, and now we're going to do some Starburst. So, these are my screws to screw in the leg. And my starburst, was, I will be eating off camera in a minute. <laughs> and we've got our little dinosaur. Oh, look at the red bottom on it too. Cute. Okay, so we want to make sure that we don't expose our cup of sores to heat over 100 degrees. Right. So we are keeping this. Set that aside. And we got some more Foamtastic. Oh, when I tell you, these things are so amazing because they literally fit every single cup that I have that I use. All right, we've got our three arms. So this is the turner, and I'm gonna let y'all in on a little secret. So this 
these are used for packaging, but I have used these on some cups before, especially those like 12 ounce cups from Walmart for kids. I've used these and they work great. So it's like you get extra foam <laughs> for your um, spinners. Let's go ahead and set this baby up. I'll be right back. All right, so we've got our legs, our screws that come with the turner, and I've got my drill. No camera today, guys. Sorry, he's at the park with Dad. All right, so we're gonna turn it upside down. like an expert <laughs> and put it in like so right all right now let's open up the screws all right And I have plugged it in. Tuck my cord under there. Beautiful. I mean, like, it's so quiet. on there. So I've got this little tiny cozy from Walmart. Alright, so see how it's in there really good and deep so that when I put epoxy on the cup it's not going to get on the foam tastic, right? And I've got this little stopper here so that I can put my rod on the turner and put the cup on there like that. And right next to that, let's get a 30 ounce cup. Shove that deep down in there so you can see. So you really don't need to tighten it really tight. So that's that one. And let's get <coughs> let's get one of these. These are very hard to find anything that will fit them. Um, and I have not tried the Fantastic on these. These are extremely hard to fit. Alright, it looks like it fits too. different size cups on here and I can totally see you know doing the epoxy method on this side 
are um, actually like if you have three cups that you need to glitter doing the epoxy method on this side transferring it over to this side when you're done like if you don't want your glitters to cross you can totally do that so let's say you have three cups in Q that you want to do the epoxy method on right you do your glitter we'll put your epoxy do your glittering okay letting it spin and then you move it on over to this side and that's spinning you put your other cup on here you epoxy you glitter let it spin for a second and drop off all that excess glitter right and then you move it over epoxy method you do your glitter and then you let it spin or take it to the nine cup turner or whatever turner that you have but I love this three cup turner I see myself utilizing it a lot especially for the early prep work like when you're doing your epoxy method or when you're doing um, your second coat of epoxy on a cup but you don't necessarily need to coat other cups. You can definitely use a smaller turner for that. I'm very pleased and I cannot wait to start using this. I'm actually gonna start using it tonight because I have a few cups I need to go ahead and prep and get started on. So that's all I have for you today. I do have a video that's coming with their hand turner. And I also have a video coming with their um, tar pit so they have cup of source has epoxy stirs um, and I have two of them because they're just that great and we'll do a video on that coming up real soon thank you so much for watching don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button and share it with your friends especially your friends that are just getting into making cups um, you definitely want to have the right quality equipment and I totally feel like Cup of Source provides you with that. Thanks again. See you next time. Bye.